Okay, let's see if your computer, also known as a rig or a kit, has enough juice to run Adobe After Effects CS4. Let's go ahead and start off with the Windows requirements, and then I'll talk about the Macintosh requirements. Alright, for the people with the PC, you're going to have to have a processor with at least 1.5 gigahertz speed. You're going to need Microsoft Windows XP with Service Pack 2, although they recommend Service Pack 3. You can also use Windows Vista in a lot of different flavors such as Home Premium, Business, Ultimate, or Enterprise with Service Pack 1. And of course that's going to have to be certified for 32-bit Windows XP and 32-bit and 64-bit Windows Vista. You're going to need 2 gigabytes of RAM. RAM is how After Effects thinks. So, you know, the more RAM the better especially if you're going to do a lot of special effects which of course is what After Effects is best at so if you can afford it get a lot of RAM in there because it could make your uh, production workflow go by more smoothly you're going to need to have 1.3 gigabytes of available hard disk space for installation plus if you want to install any of the optional content you might want to have 2 gigabytes just lying around All right you cannot install on a flash based storage device so make sure you have a real hard drive as far as your video display you should be able to display 1280 by 900 pixels with OpenGL 2.0 you're going to need a DVD-ROM drive to install and QuickTime 7.4.5 to use any QuickTime features of course if you want to download movies and images to use from service providers you're going to definitely need an online connection and of course broadband is better so you can download more quickly time is money so faster is better but of course don't forget the quality now for people with a Mac you're going to want to have a multi-core Intel processor now I'm using a Mac Pro quad-core and it handles After Effects just fine you can also have a Macintosh OS 10 version 10.4.11 or 10.5.4 you're also going to need 2 gigabytes of RAM and to install everything 2.9 gigabytes of available hard drive space plus the 2 gigabytes as the Windows people need for the additional content okay you're also going to need the same display 1280 by 900 OpenGL 2.0 graphics card a DVD-ROM drive and the same QuickTime 7.4.5 and if you're going to use the internet to download pictures just like the Windows people you will also need a broadband connection and an online service so that is the bare minimum that you'll need to run After Effects CS4 efficiently on your computer